Following a personal scandal, Police Academy instructor Lee Young Nam is transferred from Seoul to take office as a chief of the police substation in a quiet seaside town in Yasut. Young Nam keeps a low profile and tolerates the drunken excesses of the locals, but drinks heavily at home, decanting soju into water bottles. Young Nam meets Sun Doohee, a timid and withdrawn 14-year-old girl covered with cuts and bruises. Doohee is bullied by classmates and beaten by both her drunk stepfather Young Ha and drunk grandmother, her biological mother abandoned them. The locals keep quiet about Young Ha's injustices as he is the town's main employer, an oyster farmer. After the body of Young Ha's mother is found floating in the water, ruled an accidental death caused by drunk driving, Young Ha attacks Doohee again. Concerned for Doohee's safety, Young Nam offers to let her stay with her during the summer vacation, despite scrutiny from the villagers. For the first time, Doohee has someone who does not hit her and who calls her by her name instead of swearing at her. Doohee bathes with Young Nam and imitates her, wearing her uniform and cutting her hair in the same style. Young Nam is tracked to Yasu by her ex-girlfriend, who asks her to move to Australia with her. They argue and kiss, and are seen by Young Ha. When Young Nam discovers that he employs underpaid illegal immigrants, Young Ha tells the police that Young Nam sexually abused Doohee. Young Nam is taken into custody. She states she had no improper contact with Doohee and that taking in an abused child was her duty, the investigator responds that this was inappropriate behavior for a gay woman. Doohee tells the investigator that Young Nam sexually abused her, and Young Nam is imprisoned. Doohee is returned to the care of her father and given a number to call if her father beats her again. At her family home, Doohee undresses, dials the number and hides the phone, then caresses her sleeping father. He wakes and begins shouting at her. She cries in protest, telling him it hurts. The police break in and arrest the father. Doohee tells the investigators that her father told her to lie that Young Nam abused her. Young Nam is released and receives an apology. She visits Doohee and asks her if she made what happened to her father and grandmother happen on purpose, then leaves. As she is being driven out of town, she tells the officer to stop the car. She finds Doohee and asks her to come with her. Thank you for watching and see you again in another movie.